Hey guys, I'm CR2, and today I'm going to review the Lego Batman movie Scarecrow Fearful Face Off set. So, this is the box here. Uh, so you can see it's recommended for just 6 to craft, and this set, uh, 70913, and comes with two main figures, which are the Batman and also Scarecrow. So, this is the top, nothing on the sides and the bottom. And yeah, so this is the back, shows you all the features, and. Yeah, like uh, build something Batman here, and yeah, so that's it for the box. So, this is the instruction manual here, and yeah, so this is the first page, and the final page is about uh, right here. So, yeah, uh, this is the final page. So, uh, so you can see, uh, shows you the uh, the features. And also the wave of uh, Batman movie sets, which, uh, you know, I believe this is the summer sets. So, yeah, uh, and you also got the ultimate Batmobile here. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. And uh, the back, you got this uh, advertisement for Lego Batman movie app. And built something Batman, Lego Life. And also uh, the the first wave of Lego Batman movie sets. So you got the parts list at the back. And yeah, so that's it for the instruction. So these are the extra pieces here. Uh, so you can see it comes with uh, this plate, which is you know really nice to get. Uh, maybe it's on purpose, or maybe it's a uh, it's an arrow, or yeah, I'm not sure. But you know, you got a lot of studs here. You know, uh, surprised that they only included one of these, but you know, and you got two of these uh stud with a hole in the middle. Uh, you got cheese slope, round towel plate, uh, pistol, uh, right arm, and also the stud shirt piece. So yeah, overall pretty nice selection of um, uh, you know extra pieces. So the first main fit here is a uh, Batman with jetpack. So uh, yeah, you can see he's armed with uh, the grappling hook, and yeah, uh, it's the black suit Batman. Uh, there's no like uh, like any other changes or anything. So yeah, it's just the exact same. And yeah, the cow is also the the same too. So the jetpack here, uh, you got a really nice. The bat wing piece, you know, nice to get it, and yeah, so you got the flames coming out, coming out of the back, and you also got these like um, but uh, these rocket bottom pieces. Uh, I'm not sure what they are called, but yeah, they're connected to uh this um, uh, pistol piece, and yeah, so uh, you can angle this up and down, and you you can also angle this like this, but. Yeah, he can quite uh, stand very well, so yeah, but uh, let's remove the jetpack. So removing the jetpack here, uh, you know, it exposes the back printing and also the alternate expression. So you got his uh, angry face here with the closed eyes. And yeah, so this is the uh, front expression. And yeah, so it looks very really good. So yeah, let's get into the next figure. So next is Scarecrow. So you can see he has this really nice uh, helmet mode, uh, or it should be a hat mode with uh, the hair there. So yeah, it looks really good. And yeah, uh, you got a little bit of printing up here. And yeah, the mode just looks good. And I'm not sure if uh, it's new or not. I believe it's uh, it, it's been used before, but yeah, I don't know. But you know, I uh, can see uh, removing the hat, uh, it exposes his uh, face printing. And yeah, so the torso printing looks very really good. You know, you got the uh, you got tie right there. Uh, the and yeah, you, you also got uh, the leg printing, and yeah, looks very really good. And yeah, there's also like side arm printing, which uh, looks good. And yeah, uh, the printing is different on both arms. And there's also side leg printing, which is great. And yeah, there's no dual mode legs though. But yeah, so the back here uh, shows you the uh, you got the uh, back torso printing, and also you got uh, the alternate alternate expression. So yeah, 
here's how it looks with the hat on. So yeah, that's it for a scarecrow. So this is a scarecrow's gyrocopter here. Uh, so you can see the bottom here, you got these uh, skids. Uh, so the landing skids, they use uh, the broom piece, which is uh, very interesting. And yeah, uh, it's on groin arms too, so you can move it around, I guess. And yeah, so here, uh, the bottom here, uh, the base, you got this um, kind of weapon, kind of cannon thing. And yeah, I'm not sure if it's cannon or some kind of... Uh, I don't know, cross or whatever, but yeah, so the cockpit area got this little uh, control thing, and yeah, uh, you got the seat here, got the backrest, and yeah, you also got this like uh, grill piece, which yeah, it's cool, I guess, but you can just put on a scarecrow, and yep, yeah, so. Uh, this back whole back part here is connected uh, by two of these um, uh, two of these uh, like hinges or like um, uh, I forgot what it's called, but yeah, it's connected by two of these hinges. And yeah, so the top here you got this spinning rotor. So yeah, it's gray, I guess. And the uh, and the back there's also another spinning rotor. So yeah, and you got a sticker piece on each side. And yeah, uh, here you got the uh, stashers, uh, which shoot out, uh, shoots out the these like uh, canisters, uh, which has a uh, fear gas in them. And yeah, the build here is uh, really cool. And yeah, it's on both sides. So yeah, you got two of these. And yeah, uh, he can just kind of dive bomb the whole place, I guess. And yeah, so here uh, you got this. Um, Scarecrow's little like a flag or it could be a stabilizer for the gyrocopter, but yeah, uh, you know you got this really big uh, sticker piece and it's on both sides and yeah, it kind of like really like flips around, you know, I don't know why, but yeah, so you know, like uh, that's uh, really it for uh, Scarecrow's gyrocop. So uh, the the last build here is just part of the uh, Gotham City uh, power plant, which you know you you cannot uh, connect it to the other power plant builds uh, from the first wave, which is kind of sad. But yeah, it it's a cool build, I guess. Um, you, maybe you can add a clip to here, and then um, you know add a. Uh, Add another clip to the one of the other um, the power plant builds. So yeah, but you know uh, this thing here uh, it has a, a exploding feature which uh, uses the one of these um, uh, fuel gas canisters, and you can just put it in here. And yeah, this thing you can just press on this thing, and the whole top platform explodes. And yeah, you just got this railing here. And yeah, so here you got this little control panel thing with the uh, green and red light, and you also got the this uh, macaroni piece with uh, this turning wheel. And yeah, so I guess that's uh, really it for this thing. It's just on the base, and yeah, the back you got this uh, Technic axle connecting it, the whole thing. So yeah, uh, that's it for the side build. So overall conclusion of this set, so how do I think of it? So, uh, yeah, the main figures, uh, the Scarecrow is definitely a very nice main figure, and yeah, the Batman, um, yeah, kind of sad that they used the uh, black suit Batman because we just got way too many of these, and yeah, but the jetpack build is nice. The Batwing piece is nice too. And yeah, I understand why they use the black suit piece because they can't uh, put on the belt piece with the um, jetpack attach on. And yeah, so the builds, um, it's pretty cool, I guess. Uh, the side build, I like it. But the gyrocopter, yeah, I, I do like it. It's just that it's very flimsy. Like, yeah, uh, this part here, um, it keeps coming off. And yeah, this part here too, because it's only connected to uh, two of uh, two of the um, the jumper plates. And yeah, the and the back, uh, the stabilizer part here, or the flag part uh, it just keeps um, you know flopping around so yeah that's annoying and the top and the top rotor can quite can spin quite well so yeah but um, you know 
it's it's just kind of bad. But yeah, I do I do like these uh, canisters built and yeah how how they made this uh, like dive bomb feature. Yeah, I like that. So yeah, overall uh, the builds are great. It's just that uh, the gyrocopter the you know some of the parts are you know just very flimsy and everything. So yeah. Overall, it's a really cool small set, and I do recommend it. So, by links to this down in the description box below, along with all of my social media pages down in the description. So, if you want to enjoy a fancy girl alternative breaks, I'll put a link down in the description box below as well. But, thanks for watching. I'll be seeing you very soon.